chats. We are playing Scrutinized for, I believe, the fourth time. If you have not seen me play this game yet, it is basically exactly the same as Welcome to the Game, and it's made by the same people. The difference is we're in a different house, the people that are trying to get us are different, the mechanics are slightly different, and it's not based on the dark web. It is based on solving crimes from our computer. Um, like solving cases, like basically we need to read and we need to read about people, research them, and figure out if they're guilty or not guilty. Um, that is the basis of the game. We need to survive 10 nights, which is a really long time. Uh, so far we've only made it to day 5, but I'm pretty sure last time we played we died to a glitch, it seemed like. So here's to hoping no glitches or bugs today. And just straight gaming, and we win fair and square. Also, I saw a load of people are saying, congratulations, James. What happened? Could someone please tell me? Just got back from the viewing the place, applied for it, and fingers crossed, move in next month. Yo, congratulations. That's amazing. That is really exciting. Sometimes there is nothing better than like a new place. It's like a whole new breath of life. Oh, it's a, like yeah. a fresh start. I need to read that email and check out those bolos. So these are the two people that are trying to kill us. Really, really quickly, this person, uh, to stop them trying to get in and killing us, we need to catch them on the cams, basically. Uh, we can flash the cameras at them and hope that this will get rid of them. I'm going to turn my headphones up really loud now, so I'm going to ask chat very kindly to not play sound alerts. Because it is unbelievably loud. And I don't really want to be jump scared today. This is the other type of killer. Now this person can get in the house by... Basically, we need to constantly be checking that all the lights are on. And that all the windows are locked. If one of the rooms has the lights off... Then they will try and unlock the window and come in. So that's why we'll constantly be like, okay, let's check that. There are also sound cues that we're listening for. Which is why I've turned up my headphones really loud. Um, which can be like an aeroplane, a car, steps on the grass outside. I know everyone says it, but the other guy really does look like Elam. It's crazy. And he looks more like Elam in the game than he does in, in that drawing. So, to get through day one, we need to solve two, two crime cases by 4am. So I'm going to show you guys how we do that. This is our first crime case of the day. It is Susan Ellis. Uh, I would like to file an official complaint for my neighbor. Every Friday night, every weekend, there's a party. The weekend is my time to relax. Maybe get something done around the house and end the day with an ice cold beer. But those days are long gone for me now with this young lady and her parties. I barely get any sleep. What 21-year-old even has the cash, let alone the credit, to buy a house? I thought they said millennials aren't buying homes. What happened to that, huh? I guess this one hit the jackpot scoring this place to herself. She just started extending the partying to the middle of the week too. I really hope this is just a phase because I can't take much more. I need my eight hours to sleep. Okay. So at the moment, it's like... Uh, I mean, I guess there's a crime committed here in the sense of like... Uh, what's it called? Like breaking the peace or something? Um, wait, nothing on Susan Ellis. Disturbing the peace or something? But I don't know if we can file a report for that. Let's have a look what Susan Ellis has been spending money on. Strobe lights? <laughs> Fucking fog machine? <laughs> Whoa, 12 12k gold earrings? Jeez. Gas. Manicure, pedicure, pedicure. Wow. Yo, Susan is really taking care of herself. Lots of clothes. Um, some healthy shopping, food shopping. A spa retreat? Wow, and yeah, lots of lots of alcohol for partying, I guess. Um, give them an ASBO? Oh my god. I have not heard the term ASBO in years. I haven't heard that in like 10 years, man. What was that for? Antisocial behavior. Antisocial behavior... Shit, the lights are out. I can't remember what the O was for in the uh, in the ASBO. Is it just order? 
Antisocial behavior order? I did think in my head it was order, but it didn't sound right when I said it all in one go. It is order, okay. Do Asbos still exist or are they a thing of the past? Basically, chat, Asbos were like a UK thing. Um, pretty much given to like younger teens and stuff for like loitering and whatever. Disturbing the peace and stuff like that. Man, I haven't heard that in such a long time. So, I'm not really finding anything on Susan Ellis. But is it, a, even if we find proof that she's been having all these parties, is, is that a crime? Like, would we file this as guilty or not guilty? I actually genuinely don't know because basically, chat, if we get five of these cases wrong, we actually lose the game. We're hacking into the mother load, hacking the phone, hacking the phone. I would like the answer to that one, Bador. Yes, please. Should I delete my social profile? Uh, how to stay in contact with your friends without social media. How to make Jolo shots. How to stop parents from calling me every day. How to have fun in your first house. It's not a subathon. No, it's not a subathon. Best and most expensive clothing stores near me. How do I let a guy know I like him without looking desperate? Okay. Party pictures. Damn, these are very early 2010 party photos. Well, at least they look like it. Um, aren't the receipts evidence? Oh, wait, no, sorry, Bador. I didn't want to know if they were innocent or guilty. I wondered... Like, in this game, obviously, we're trying to solve crimes, right? But if the report is saying they're having antisocial parties or whatever, and we can find proof that they're doing that, like, is that... Goth boy, click. Is that a crime? Let's get this subathon going. Oh my god, I just turned my aircon off and instantly it feels like a sauna in here. Uh, Pretty Shah, thank you so much for the five months. Not a subathon, but thank you so much. I haven't seen this game yet. Yo, this is such a good game. I've been really enjoying this one. Is it a crime to party? No. But is it a crime to disturb your neighbors all the time? I think so. Uh, deleted social media. I decided it felt too consuming. Consuming too much of my time. More time to party. Okay. So I believe the answer is that this isn't a crime. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna file this one. We're gonna shred it. So yeah, so this one was innocent. Oh, and by the way, if we beat four cases today, we get to go to bed early, which just means that it's like more more of a speed run, I guess, because the days are pretty long. And we need to survive 10 of them, guys. <laughs> My headphones are so fucking loud. I actually can't tell you how scary that is. Oh, that's got the old ticker going, chat. Got the old ticker going. All right, David Reddit man. David, Re David Reddit man. <laughs> Oh wait, only one D. Only one D? Oh, there they are. That's all their details. Perfect. So now we can look them up in the DMV database. Um, so we're looking for a male, 38 years old. Height is going to be 5'8". Five, five 130 LBs. Uh, hair color is going to be brown, and eye color is going to be hazel. Uh, Lee Salm, thank you so much for the gift. It's up to rabbits. I really appreciate that. That's very kind. Thank you. There we go. So we have their ID. Basically, chat, if, you're if this is your first time seeing it, we cannot file um, a report on someone as guilty unless we manage to get their ID. Super glad to be starting work as a hairdresser, blah, blah, blah. Did you know my birthday is in seven days? Okay, cool. Um... I'm just gonna check. Wow, I was just. I'm just gonna check all the lights are on. 
And then we're going to look into this case because I haven't actually read about what they've done yet. Uh, Ruby, thank you for the follow. I guess if anyone's new here, please don't forget to follow the stream. I'm trying to grind for a uh, 100k. One day. One day we'll get there, maybe. Okay. All the lights are on, so we're chilling. Um, I do just need to check these windows are locked because the lights are off in here for a second. Yeah, now nah, we're fine. Thanks, Lee Salman. We're getting there. We're getting there slowly but surely. Got to keep chipping away. Right, so David has been accused of. Last night I was in my backyard trying to, trying to save the clothes on the line from getting wet from the rain. I saw Reddit man next door kicking a human-shaped black plastic, plastic bag and dragging it into the house. I want to believe the sleeping pills I took last night had me halluc- <sighs> Damn it. Internet went out again. I want to believe the Need sleeping pills I took last night had me hallucinating the whole sequence, but I can't be sure. The thing is, David is a good guy, but I swear to gentle Jesus that I saw a body bag last night. It could have been nothing, but you never know. I do want to consider the implications that can bring. Oh, I do not want to. So please check it out. Okay. I think that's a valid report to look into, yeah. We need to go and reset the, um... We need to go and reset the internet, which is in here. So this is where we reset the internet chat. And there's another room we need to go to if the power trips. If all the lights go out, we have to go and turn that on. The girl's voice is genuinely so hot. Nice. We're beating this game today, by the way, chat. No copium. No kappa, no, none of that. I'm just like, we're beating this game today. We need to beat this game. Um, okay, let's check the cams really quick. <gasps> Car sound cue. So, we heard the car chat, but I believe because we don't see anyone, that means we're okay for now. So let's come off the cameras. I'm just going to check the lights are still on. Okay, cool. They are. Right. Um, let's start looking into this, because this does sound really, really sus. I think I already tried to... Oh, we already pulled up the socials, didn't we? Because that's how we got the ID. So let's see what David's been spending money on. And while we're doing that, wait, have I spelled it? Oh, I spelled read it wrong again. Let's see what they've been spending money on. Uh, hairbrush and hair dye. Lots of hair dye. And baked beans and bread. <laughs> Yo, I rate that. Oh, I did not mean to go on cams. Oops. Let's hack the phone. Um, wait, what? No phone records? I don't think I've ever seen that before. Let's see if there's any police records on this guy. Oh, sim not roots. Oh, thank you. I pressed the wrong thing. I was going to say, I've never seen it before where they don't have a number like that. Right, here we go. Let's hack the phone. Hacking, hacking, hacking. We're in. Okay, search history. Good TV shows, how to get 1080p. Running out of good shows to watch. Wow, this guy seems... How to get gold, platinum. Missing a golden opportunity in life. This guy seems... Like a hairdresser. It was probably just a bag of hair. The mannequin was out in the rain, and your shitty plastic bag had a huge hole. Okay, this guy is innocent. Well, I know we don't need evidence for innocence, but... Yeah, again, like just talking about the mannequin outside. Okay, I'm going to file this one as innocent, and hopefully it's right. Nice. Okay, let's actually try and do another case, but before I do that... 
Let's just make sure all the lights are on. Hello, Kajel. What's up, Gracie? Hello, Restless Ella. Good to see you guys. Happy Tuesday. What's up, Steve? Hi, Stevie. <gasps> lights are off. Hello. Window is still locked, though. We're chilling. Um, so, yeah, if we can solve two more cases today, we get to go to bed early, which is, I think, worth giving it a go. The more cases we learn off by heart chat, the faster we can beat this game because the cases are always the same, basically. If you get a duplicate, it's, like, going to have the same result. Let's check the cams really quick. Yeah, I don't see anything. Okay. Um, right. Mick Tom Tomp set. Around 5.30 p.m. I went to drop Gas off some boy, stuff for Mick. I usually drop it off at the same time every week, but I was running 30 minutes late, and when he answered the door, the house reeked. It smelled like old lady perfume and lemon cleaner. He was acting very way more jittery than usual, but he didn't seem too bothered that I was late. Dude is very punctual. We've definitely done this one before. I found what looked like a bullet casing in the grass on the way out, but it turned out to be a cap from a lipstick thing. Ah, oh, shit. We definitely did this one before, and I cannot remember if they were guilty or not. Um, damn it. Age 68. Height 58. There's banging on the window, but I think it's fake. I think that's just a bait noise. Male. Hair is gray. Eyes are brown. Okay, there we go. We got the ID. Now, let's... Wait, what are they actually posting out on socials? And let's also look what they've been spending money on. Uh, they've been spending a lot of money on dog bits and men's razors, men's aftershave, ankle socks, and liquid cool... So he's been shaving his own legs, maybe? I'm pretty sure this is looking innocent. Before you submit the last report, if you're going to go for four, make sure light's on and cam safe before that. Oh, interesting. Okay, thank you. Uh, I can't remember if that was the right sim, so let's have another look. Oh my god, the dog had been pooing everywhere. This guy was innocent. I'm so sure of it, guys. Let's go. I remember that one now. Yeah, it was just dog poo everywhere. Okay, I think cameras look good. Um, it's 2 a.m., so we do have time to do another report. Let's just make sure all the lights are on still. I feel like every time we play this game, we're getting better and better. And by the way, chat, on Steam, it says only four people have ever beaten this game before, so we're going to go off those numbers. And if that's true, then we today will become the fifth people to ever beat this game. If we just all count ourselves as one person. Um, okay, Max Snow. That doesn't sound like a real name. It sounds like a Max Power type name, but it could be a real name. You ever met someone and think, that's a serial killer? Yeah, I have. Her name's Max Snow. We're both students at the local uni and we're in the same pre-med track. There is millions of us, yeah, but we'll have to count as one person for this example. We're in the same pre-med track, doing our autonomy class together, but we're not exactly close. Anyway, she's fucking weird, awkward as shit, always looks like she's crawled out of bed five minutes before class. Wow, this is judgy. Like she's hiding a secret. I tried to avoid her because of it, but the anatomy class made it hard. She's so weird about the, about the bodies. She gets this look in her eyes that I get when someone puts up a plate of cake in front of me. We got paired up to finally do a dice... Goth boy, click. Jeez! Hope everyone has a wonderful day. Very hot in Germany today. Stay hydrated, everyone less than three. True. Please do stay hydrated, guys, because it is actually insanely hot. Catgoy, thank you so much for the five months. I'm sorry I jumped to your sub. I just have my headphones on so loud right now. Um, 
The whole time she was cutting the cat, she was just muttering something about when can we do this on an actual body. I'm like, why so impatient? She cut the cat with ease, blah, blah, blah. I hear an airplane. Okay, I don't see anything. I'm, I am really feel like we're going to have to do one more lights check because I'm panicking. I just really want to beat this game. But I know we should focus on this case because I just want to... Oh, shit! Lucky we did a lights check. Oh, the window was unlocked! Holy shit! This fucker got the window unlocked! That's so lucky we did another light check, guys. I, like, I might- <gasps> I swear I just saw someone there. See, it might seem like I'm excessively checking the lights are on, and maybe sometimes I am, but... I can hear a car. Could he be in the breaker closet? I'm gonna say that I don't think so because um, the window wasn't actually open. Okay, so just like study stuff. Uh, no social spy. Let's have a look at the sim database. I would be dead if they got in, yeah. I think the uh, I think the only one that hides in the closet is the doctor. <laughs> Fuck, I, I suck. I had 10 whole seconds to do that and I still failed it. Oh. Uh, let's see if there's any police records. No police records. Basically, chat, if you fail the phone hack, we have to now wait a while before we can actually check it again. Wait, I don't actually have to check the bathroom? Because there's no window? It's always been something I've wondered about, but I've always been like, well, if it gets dark, it's just too scary. There could be someone in there still. I would always check the bathroom. Hi, Omi. This without audio has removed so much of the anxiety. Yeah, I guess that's like any horror or scary thing ever. It's just not really scary when there's when the sound's muted. I need to get in this phone now. Like, right now. Otherwise, we're not going to be able to s solve the case. I don't really care if we get the early bedtime or not, but I just want to solve for today for the sake of it. I once caught Heather hiding in my bathtub watching Spongebob. I'm so sorry that happened to you, man. Yeah, you're right. I don't actually have ID. I think we're just going to run out of time. Our character's going to fall to sleep in a second. Oh, the internet's off. Yeah, we are not going to be able to solve another case today. That's okay. That's all right. I think we did great. It's a good start, but... We're going to have to be a lot quicker than that if we want to beat the game. Because soon we're going to have to start solving a lot more cases a day. Oh, Hev, that's really sweet, actually. You guys sound like you have a great relationship. Was she guilty? I don't know. I actually don't know. I guess we'll never know. Night two. Okay, so I've unlocked $10. I think if I solved another case, we would have had more more of those coins. Those coins are actually really fucking helpful. Because we can buy instant hacks with those coins. Um, which means... I can instantly hack phones and never fail. 
jelly beans don't ever- My actual heart just stopped for a second, I swear. Kelly beans, don't ever do that ever again. Ever again. Good morning. You can't just say good morning, babe, after doing that, man. That's not how it works. Good morning, though. Thank you for the bits. <laughs> Who did that? Who's getting banned? We're not doing that. So is it true, guys? I really don't ever need to check the bathroom. Even if the light's off in there, it just doesn't matter. Almost lost the streamer today. What's up, BMOP? Okay, we never need to check the bathroom. That's actually going to save a lot of time. That's good to know. Oh, it was just locked. That's fine. Okay, we're going to check the cameras, and then we're going to get straight into solving crimes, because we need to solve a lot more cases than that. Today, we need to solve three to make it through the day. There is... Absolutely no one or nothing on cams by the looks of things. So, first case of the day, let's do this. We're looking at Magnus Solomon Solomon Solomonson Solomons Solomon's son Solomonson. Um, I went out to the other night. I went out the other night to grab a little bite to eat and saw my neighbor sitting at a table across the way eating what looked like a completely raw liver. I didn't even know you could do something like that in the restaurant. If that wasn't strange enough, I saw him dig up some meat tea buried in his backyard from what I imagined was foreign meat aging process. When he peeled open the package, the stench that came out sent me... Okay, wait. This actually sounds like... Wait. Oh, I spelled it wrong. Thanks, guys. There we go. This sounds fucking sus. So they've been spending money on flesh around a w the world, where they've been eating human eyes and raw bat wings and all- uh, Wow, okay. This is- Is this not a crime to have human eyes? And a shovel. Let's put the sh- Let's- Oh! I heard the car. What's up, Zek Fruit? Good to see ya. <laughs> oh! No, I'm actually turning down my headphones. That's way too loud. That's actually fucking unbelievably loud. I can't do that. I've just screamed. <sighs> That's enough of that chat. Let's not do that again. Because you actually just made me scream. I'm going to have to go check if the lights are on now. Okay, that's really nice not having to check the bathroom, actually. That really fucking scared me. That, like, really took it out of me a little bit, man. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, we have the phone. I think really important. Oh, wait, I need to buy my hacks. Wait, oh my god, I had so much money. I have six instant hacks. Let's go. I'm not gonna use them unless I really need them. Nice. Didn't even need it. Was it you, Kaylin? Thank you for the bits. Um, great American horror films. Understanding American traditions and values. How to prepare hakarol in the States. I don't know what that is. Getting friends to try Icelandic delicacies. Best place to find raw food. Is this... This isn't... I don't think this is a crime. It's just fermented foods, but the human eyeballs feels like it might be a crime. I've been trying- I've been dying to try this buried meat you've been cooking up. Wait, this guy's just innocent. Hakarol would be my last meal, it's sublime. Buried, buried, aged meats. Uh, 
I like that they said they don't actually serve human. I think the eyes were some type of gelatin or other animal eye. But he's like, he's saying yeah. But then we know he's ordered animal eyes. Guys, I'm so confused whether this is like a crime or not. Because I obviously aging meats in the ground is not No police record. Aging meets... I'll check cams, yeah. I was going to check the lights, actually. I did just hear an aeroplane. Shit, you're right. Okay, I'm going to go check the rooms. Check the lights are on. I can't figure out if there's something wrong here. Because everything is fine. Like, aging meets in the ground, whatever... Icelandic tradition or whatever it is. But the human eye bit is really throwing me off and that feels like a crime. I don't know what to do. I think I'm just going to go for it. I think I'm going to go innocent. Oh, they were innocent. Thank God. Okay. Right. Okay, let's do this. Um, Janet Hudson. And this person is... Chat, also, if you are if you have better memory than me, please try and remember these cases. Because once we solve them once, we shouldn't have to solve them again. I just have really bad memory. So as long as we've solved it, I don't really mind you guys being like, Oh, we've done this one, they're innocent. Like, that's, that's chill. As long as there's like a couple of people that are sure it was innocent, I think, I think I'm okay with that. So age 50. I just heard a step. I just heard a step and I don't know whether I need to check the cameras or the, the lights. No, I swear I can see. Ah, oh, fuck, I might be dead, guys. I swear I can hear someone in the house. Okay, that window's still locked. <gasps> Bro, why are all the lights off? That's locked. Okay, we're fine. We're chilling, we're chilling. Random thought, but does anyone else watch back random clips of Koji when they're sad because I swear they're serotonin for me? Wait, what the hell? That's really lovely. I'm really glad to hear that, man. That's really nice. Okay, age 50. Female. Height, 5'10". Weight, 150. Hair brown, eye brown. Okay, this should get us the eye... Oh! Janet Hudson. There we go. ID card secured. Um... I get the impression that my nature, Mrs. Hudson, leads a secret double life. She has young men in and out all the time. She has an incredible amount of... Oh wait, isn't this just the OnlyFans person? I think this was... I think this was fine. I think we did this one and it was like OnlyFans. Maybe I should read the cases before I even look at them. Wait, rotten meat? I'm gonna have to pause chat. I need to go pee really, really bad. If you haven't taken your meds or your vitamins and you're watching on YouTube or Twitch, make sure you go and do that, okay? This is your reminder. I will be right back. Oh my God, it's so hot. <gasps> wow. Let's get that aircon back on. That is unbearable, man. Wow. Um. I got myself a nice cold can of drink chat because why not? It's a really hot day. Oh yeah, so we're solving this case and we need to find out. Oh my god, cheers to that chat. <laughs> cheers, darling. Snailson shared a wonderful clip if you'd like to watch. Cheers, darling. Where is it? Oh no. 
Oh, not this clip, man. Bro. <laughs> I did find that really funny, apparently, yeah. I'm sorry, what was that? Don't worry, it's just a it's just a forehead. I know it looks like something else, but it is just a forehead, it's okay. Alright. Let's get let's get back into this case. I'm pretty sure your laugh is so different now. No, that was just me like uncontrollably laughing when I knew it, I knew it was really immature so I was like trying not to laugh but I was also like panicking and laughing and I just I don't know it was a very exceptional laugh that's not my everyday laugh man uh all right I, I, I can't remember if this is the only fans case or not three men would be come for the final coating yeah this was the only fans person I'm sure of it Yeah, this was just an innocent, I'm pretty sure. Oh, thank goodness, we got it right again. Let's go. Okay, so see, like, playing the game a lot and building the knowledge um, makes this game so much easier. I am going to have to turn my headphones up again, though, because I can't hear everything. It's because my aircon is really loud. Okay. Oh. I just looked outside the window and Abby is just out there sunbathing and I'm incredibly jealous. Just chilling in the sun, man. Okay. Unknown. I saw a woman who appeared to be luring a kid into a white van. An older man was driving it. When I went over to investigate further, she started stuttering like she was on crack or something and tried to get this kid inside the vehicle faster. I managed to talk to her, but she said that she had to get going because her kid was late for soccer. They sped off quickly, so I assumed she was telling the truth. Fuck, I think... I think we've done this one before, and I can't remember the answer to it. So, 20 to 30, height... Oh, wait, height is 5. Weight, 135. Gender, female. Hair, brown. Eyes, hazel. I think... I'm pretty sure we've done this one. Okay, Nina Winter. Um, let's see what Nina's been spending money on. And let's look at her socials as well. Victorian chair. And a phone charger. Um, no socials, right? Let's have a look what they've been texting about. Also check the police records, I guess. Nina Winter. Oh. Nice. Double hack. Let's go. Uh, how to make realistic dead body makeup. Realistic skull props. Wow, we're getting so many innocent people today. Can I keep the prop bodies at your house? This is another innocent person. What the hell? Wait, do I have to solve seven cases to go to bed early? Jesus, that's a lot of cases. I don't know if we can do that by 4 a.m., but let's try. Let's just go check. <gasps> I did think I heard the lights go out. God damn it. You know what? That aircon is just too loud. I can't hear the game over it. Okay. All the lights are still on. This is the run, chat. This is the run. I have a feeling. This, is, this has got to be the run. 
Also, look at this. 4 p.m. and we've already been live for like two hours. You'll love it. You'll love to see it. Okay, Mabel Gibbons. I've worked in Dr. Gibbons' office for six years. She's such a talented shrink. Wait, Cams. What's up, rabbits? Welcome back. Hello, SGWD. Um... Nice, Kara, man. I'm so glad. Um, she's such a talented shrink. She's probably the greatest thing I've ever seen. She's probably the greatest I've ever seen. She helped her patients through almost everything. Um, I read in the newspaper today that sh that someone who I could swear was a former patient of hers robbed a bank. My doubt comes with the fact the guy in the paper had a different name than the patient I was thinking of. Maybe I'm right. Maybe I'm wrong. Um, is that even a crime? I guess if she was making them, if she was brainwashing them into committing crimes for her, but it seems unlikely. Okay, every, oh, internet's off. Been having a super special day, I'm glad you're streaming. Hi, Bean. Hopefully the stream can, uh, help you relax and chill out a little bit. I'm sorry to you had a stressful day. Uh, can I give you a time-saving hint? Depends. How... Hmm. I'm not sure. If it doesn't... If it's like just a little game mechanic thing, then yes, probably. If it's too much of a spoiler, though... N no, thank you, I think think this is gonna be a hard one to solve because I'm not really sure what we're looking for well look I guess we're looking for a connection between magic kit optical illusions I guess we're looking for a connection between the shrink and the bank robber oh Oh. Nice, we're in. Um, hypnosis, mentalism, magic shows coming up near me. Psychological studies and research from places. Um, make your friends do things for you. Wait, we might be on to something here. Who was- what was the bank robber called? Oh, it doesn't say. I'm having these weird dreams of me stealing. God, guys, this is gonna take... a really long time to solve this one. But once we've solved it once, we never have to solve it again, as long as we remember it. Everything is fine. With a few more sessions, you'll stop having these dreams altogether. It feels so real, though, but I understand. Wait, is it done? Have you done what I asked? Are you awake? Bro, they're guilty! Wait, are they actually guilty? I think I've panicked and closed the text too early. Height 5-6. Oh, turn the lights. Oh, I just dribbled a nut. Guys, what's that noise? I heard owls. Owls Owls is a sound cue for the cams. That noise scared me. Wait, Twilight Princess Tier 3 sub? Thank you so much for the six months Tier 3. That is unbelievable. Uh, wait, unknown. Female... Hair brown, eyes hazel. Can we please get some love in the chat? Twilight Princess, thank you so much for the tier three for six months. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Um, I'm scared. I'm scared about the lights being off. Whoa, that's a lot of love Happy in the chat. Months. Let's go. Code chart, did I miss much of the game? Uh, no, I think we're only on day two, actually. That's how slow this game is. And we've got to make it to day 10. 
But we are kind of just killing it right now. Just trying to let... Oh! Also, guys, what's really scary... You can actually catch the robber by the window. Well, they're not a robber. Well, I guess they are. A breaker and enterer. You can catch them coming through the window. And it scares them off. We did it last time we played. It's so scary. All the time. Thank you for the 20 months. Welcome back. I really appreciate that. I really want to go... I'm going to have to... Go I'm such an idiot, man. I, I closed the... I closed the phone hack too early. I should have read more of the messages. I just got excited and panicked. How do you do it? It takes years for some patients of mine to get better. Hmm. Is it done? Have you done what I've asked? Will you see? No. Drop it off at my practice next session. Oh, what the hell? Okay. Wait, if Victoria isn't dead by tomorrow, make sure she meets her end, Zachary. Thank you. <gasps> That's a different case, though. So let's just file... Hopefully this is the right evidence. Let's go. We got it right, chat. I can hear really loud wind. But I don't see anyone on cams. Okay. So the psychiatrist, uh, the shrink. If we ever get that case again, they are guilty. All we need... Oh, but you still need to attach the right evidence. So it was text evidence. It was all phone evidence, basically. Text and searches. Cool. Wait, was that wind or did I hear... You got it right, but because you had one wrong evidence, you lost some money. Oh, I didn't even notice that. So the wrong evidence would have been... Well, the Google search was like how to get people to do things for you. And then the text was saying, is it done? So maybe I attached the wrong texts? Because I feel like that was pretty good evidence. Sorry, car man. No longer checking the bathroom. The text was right. Okay, cool. The search was wrong. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Luke Bennett. I know we don't probably have time to solve this, but we should try and learn the cases anyway. I saw Luke walking through the neighborhood in the early afternoon. He was wearing a shirt and his backpack had some dark stains on it. I thought high school didn't get out for another two weeks or so. In this case, I wonder if he cut class today to do something. He looked pretty messed up like he was drunk or on drugs. Uh, I know seniors cut a day where they will go to the beach or something. Maybe today was senior cut day and he was afraid I was going to rat him out to his mum. What's, what's the crime? Looking to see if he skipped school today? Oh. I love Casey Green. Casey Green is a cheating bitch. <gasps> Fuck. Oh, we solved this? He's the young one you thought was, he was smoking? Wait, but didn't that one say something about you? he was, like, going into the forest or something? Oh! Most of the scene... Oh. I think that was a different one. Oh, wait, I need to get on his socials to get his details. Okay, Luke Bennett, male. 18 years old. 5'9". Five, 183 LBs. I'm a little bit stressed out, chat. I feel like it's all so quiet. Why is it so... Sp Everything feels so quiet and safe right now. And it's not safe. Okay, we got his ID. Let's have a look. I mean, even though, like, he's saying that Casey is a cheater or whatever. But that's not even what the report's about. It's not a crime. His girlfriend cheated, right? 
We're not, like, looking for, like, other crimes in their phones. Like, if we found text of this guy saying he'd killed someone, I don't even think we can report it. How to know if someone is cheating, how to get revenge on a cheater. Can police tell if a dead body has been touched? So, guys, I don't get this game. So, Bedore, right? You know this game really well. If this guy, if there's evidence on this guy's phone that he's killed someone, we still can't, even if we file him as guilty. Goth boy, click. Wouldn't that be wrong? Because it's not the case, what we're supposed to be looking for? I, I actually don't really get it sometimes. What's up, Thales? Uh, Seasha, thank you so much for the 16 months. Says, on this hot day, I'm drinking a nice can of Diet Cock. I'm having a Coca-Cola Zero. I hope you enjoy. Especially any in which he screams makes a bad mood so much better. I'm glad that me screaming makes you feel better. What's up, Lost Boy? Doesn't it have to be what they're being accused of? Nothing more, nothing less? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it has to be what they're accused of, but I'm pretty sure they're only being accused of skipping school. Uh, he was walking through the neighborhood. He wasn't wearing a shirt and his backpack had some dark stains on it. I thought high school didn't get out for another two weeks or so. Wonder if he cut class. He looked like he was on drunk, uh, drug, drunk or on drugs. I know most seniors like take a day to go party in the woods or whatever. Maybe today was senior cut day and he was afraid I was going to rat him out to his mum. Like, it's so vague. <laughs> Did I just lose at 4 a.m.? That's n oh my god. Guys, I I, 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 it didn't even scare me because I was just. That's never happened before. Fuck. Goth boy, click. Oh my god. That's Wait. Tough. So apparently that's happened because there were lights off when I went to bed. That has never happened before because usually I don't stay at the computer till 4 a.m. like that. Usually I'm like, if I'm like done at 2 a.m. with all the cases, I'm like running around the house making sure all the lights are on and stuff. Fuck, man. Medella, thank you for the follow. And Teddy Paws, thank you for the five months. That is tough. That is tough. My god, we have almost done 100 subs today. What the... What the... What are we? What the flip? Okay. What happened to playing Observation Duty 6 after only playing one game? Nana Milky, you are right. That is... I did say that. So, I'm gonna do a poll right now, and you guys can decide what we do for the next two hours. Because I literally cannot beat this game before I have to go now, I don't think. Because I would have to beat it in an hour and 40 minutes. Is that right? Four, five, six. Yeah. Carry on scrutiny. Carry on scrutinized. Observation duty six. Which is the new I'm on observation duty if you guys didn't know. Um, it just came out and I brought it today. Uh, the same way you said it's a subathon. It's, I, guys, it's not a subathon. I, I, I don't know what to say. Okay, guys, I have thrown up a poll there. There's three options. You guys can vote for exactly what you want. What time of game is Observation Duty? We've played it a lot on stream. Um, I might as well, like, start a game, because I'm pretty sure you, you can save and come back and continue another time. So even if I just make sure everything's locked up while you guys vote in the poll, that's great. It's not a subathon, chat. Oh, wait, you can't save. That always throws me off, because it's... Save is only on casual mode. Okay. Oh, it's such a close poll. I, I I did think that Paleo wouldn't get very many votes, but that's okay. It's the same thing with Stardew Valley. Stardew Valley used to get like three votes every time we polled it. And then when I started playing it all the time, everyone loved it. The problem is, chat, like I can't... It's not like, oh, I have to go at six. But I'll stay anyway because I have a problem getting off games and I'll be like, LG, LG, LG. I actually have to go before 6. I have to be in the meeting at 6. 
so I don't think I can complete this game in time. Observation Duty is the game where it's like spot the difference, but it's horror. We've played it a lot on stream. You've become a horror game streamer to me now, so horror games over any games. I've al I mean, I've always been a horror game streamer. I just go through phases where I really enjoy them and then I don't play them for a long time. Like, there's no way I can beat this game in an hour and 40 minutes, is there? Or an hour and a half. An hour and a half is when I have to go, guys. Stardew is busting, yeah.